Hello, my name is Sarah Young, and welcome to A Journey of a River, the Elbe River, one of the major rivers of Central Europe. The river flows 678 miles from the northern part of the Czech Republic and northward to the North Sea. Prague is known as the gateway to the Elbe. It is also known as the city of 1,000 spires. It is also the largest city of the Republic, and its architecture spans many styles, from the classical to the Rococo. The astronomical clock dates from 1410. Each hour, death rings the death knell and turns an hourglass upside down while twelve apostles proceed along the windows. Beer is a part of the culture of the Czech Republic. It has a long and storied history dating from 900 AD. The last century found this country in turmoil, including many hardships on the Jewish citizens. Throughout history, the river has been important. In the Middle Ages, it formed the eastern limit of Charlemagne's empire. It passes along the former border of East Germany, through Dresden, Meissen, Saxon Switzerland, Torgau, Wittenberg, and on to Hamburg. Dresden enjoys a long history as the capital and royal residence for the electors and king of Saxony. It was also known as the jewel box of Europe for its Baroque and Rococo city center, which was entirely destroyed in World War II by Allied forces in a controversial bombing. Fortunately, through worldwide efforts, the city is being restored to its former Baroque splendor. The city of Meissen is well known for its beautiful porcelain production. Having been produced since 1710, Meissen porcelain is the first high quality, high fire, hard paste porcelain to be produced outside of the Orient. By 1700, porcelain from China and Japan represented wealth, importance, and refined taste. Not to be outdone and using alchemists, the King of Saxony was able to duplicate the procedure, creating what became known as white gold or porcelain. The town is located mostly around the market at the foot of Castle Hill 
and it contains many buildings of Renaissance architecture. The famous Meissen Gold Riesling is produced along the banks of the Elbe. The medieval town of Torgau is best known as the place which commemorates the meeting of the U.S. and Soviet forces during World War II. April 25, 1945 later became known as Elbe Day. The Elbe River also witnessed the birthplace of Protestant Reformation in the town of Wittenberg. We walk in the footsteps of Martin Luther and pass the Catholic Church where he first posted his 95 theses criticizing Catholic Church practices of selling indulgences. Moving away from the Baroque formal gardens, the Wurlitzer Garden was one of the first English gardens established along the Elbe. And in further tracing world history, this palace hosted Churchill, Truman, and Stalin in 1945 as they wrote history and determined the partition of Germany. That plan of partition was to divide the country and the city of Berlin. A Cold War developed between the Allies and the Soviets. Erected literally in the dead of night, the Berlin Wall stood for 28 years as the physical manifestation of this divide. As communism began to falter on November 9, 1989, the borders were open between East and West Berlin as suddenly as they had been closed. Only one example of East Berlin and East Germany remains, the cult pedestrian crossing known as the Men in Hats. As a byproduct of the German reunification, the city of Berlin has become a world city of culture, politics, and science. Not technically along the banks of the Elbe River, the city of Berlin is linked to the river through canals. And so, to rejoin the river, we venture through Germany's lake country and the beautiful town of Schwerin. The town is known for its impressive wealth and historical architecture. Our final stop along the river is the city of Hamburg, the second largest city in Germany. Although during World War II, severe air raids devastated much of the city and harbor, the city has been rebuilt. The port of Hamburg is considered Germany's gateway to the world. It is the fourth largest container terminal in the world.
public transportation is easy and efficient in the city, but it is the miniature wonderland that holds the world's largest model railway. The German people as a whole are known as a Stoic people that strive for perfectionism and precision in all aspects of their lives, but they also have a keen sense of community and social conscience and a desire to belong, as well as an incredible zest for living. Without a doubt, they were the deepest and strongest team in the 2014 World Cup. Food has always been a major part of German life. As the country was partitioned in the last century, East Germany took on an aspect of a more Russian style of cooking. Many Germans eat a heavy and hearty meal, and throughout the country, desserts are popular. Much of the penchant of precision by the Germans is seen in their architecture. This very brief journey has allowed us to see the natural beauty of former East Germany landscape and the breathtaking scenery along the mystic Elbe. It is a river unlike other European rivers in which the course of this river is predominantly natural unaltered by human technology. The River Elbe is a river of historical significance. And what a beautiful journey.